Cal will be the uh, Guardian starting pitcher. He is one and two on the year, 393 earned run average, and 20 walks in his 34 and a third innings. He, I like him when he goes out there, he throws strikes. High pop foul, uh, fly ball near third base, uh, Jose Ramirez. Like makes the catch on now. And a hard hit ball to third base. Jose Ramirez scoops it up. He's ready for the task. Two down. Takes the first fly ball and the first ground ball. Swung out and miss. He got him. And Cal Quantrill, sharp right out of the gate, sets him down. One, two, three. Tyler Malley, the starter for the Red Legs. He's, He's making start number 103 of his major league career, 27 years old. He's two and four this year. Down the line. Headlong dive, TJ Friedel. What a play by Friedel. That's going to burn a little bit on the exposed forearms, but hopefully he's going to be all right as he makes the play and gets out number one. But that's a nice way to start the ball game, get your pitcher a nice out. Grounded to Boustakis, who had backed up with two strikes. Two down. Sky, shallow center. Almora makes the firm call and the catch. Malley had to battle against Ramirez, but ultimately, one, two, three. There There's, you a, go. There's a nice perfect. shot to the gap. He's going to turn and go hard to second base. Good throw, but it's a little bit offline. And Miller beats the tag for a leadoff double. Now there's a double that he earned coming out of the batter's box. That ball, he, he got an inside fastball. He hits the other way. And I'll tell you what, he's going to challenge it. And Arch helped the kids at home to learn. The right fielder was left-handed running the other way. That plays into yeah, it. Yeah, right? and he, yes, they're not coming in at it. He's, he's got to turn and make a throw. And you're challenging that he doesn't make a good throw. Throw and he did not. Up the just, middle, it's a CNI single. Knocked out by Farmer, but he'll have no play. And in Guardians at the corners now with nobody out. That's a heck of a job by Farmer because that probably saved at a least run. for the moment saved a run. Yeah, it saved a run. You're right. And the Franimal steps to the plate. High fly ball, deep center field. Beck is Almora on the track and makes the catch near the base of the wall. Scoring easily is Miller, and holding at first is Rosario. And Fran Mel Reyes, the frustration evident, he got down, he was almost at first base when he saw that ball die. But Reyes gets the job done. They take a one nothing lead. Smoked over third, base hit. Uh, now I see why he was throwing breaking pitches to Drury. Here's the 1-1. One, one. Swung on, line drive, center field. That'll get down for a base hit. Drury's going to try to go to third. Straw's throw is in time, and they got him! What a throw by Miles Straw, and I'm not sure why Brandon Drury decided to test him. Well, I'll tell you why. He tried to slow play him and act like he was cruising into second base, and, and Miles Straw didn't bite, and he made an excellent throw in it. You were in scoring position. There's nobody out. You don't want to make that out at, first, at third base. But he does. And Miles Straw threw a seat. How he stopped yeah. and slow played it. Our sprint jury is not fast enough to try that move. No, I, I, <laughs> I got serious. you. And that's assist number seven now for, uh, for Miles that Straw. Throw. That was right on the money. Swung on, ground ball, right side. They're going to turn two here. Beautiful. And the inning is over. Well done. What a job by the defense. Tyler Naquin, the batter. Naquin fly to left his first time up. That is rocked by Naquin. Deep left center. And God, Tyler Naquin tattoos a line drive homer and ties the game at one. Well, it was almost the same swing that he had the last time up. And I mentioned it looked like he was really trying just to hit a home run the left field. He got under it a little bit. It turned out to be an easy fly ball. This time, you could really see him going that way. He can get it. Double play. Have one. Oh, so we can do it that way. Now the second base, it will be an Asking ending, you ending. shall receive. Double play. Miller makes the play at first. And a good throw down the second to retire the Reds. Here in the fifth, we're tied at one halfway through. High in the air, left center. Almora up the wall makes the catch. Oh. Sensational play. Well, we've seen over the years Albert Almora Jr. playing for the Cubs and really turning in some real web gems when it comes to defense. This time he's got plenty of time to gauge that ball is calling it and he times his jump perfectly takes an extra base hit away from the big guy. 
Pretty well hit, but better position. Brandon Drury. The shift taketh away. Another one, two, three inning for Malley. Not only has no one reached, there hasn't been a productive out since. Third strikeout for Malley, and that's 13 in a row, retired by the Reds right hander. Hit in the air, right field. Coming on, TJ Friedel toward the line. He'll make the catch. Quad goes. And he struck him out. Jose Ramirez entered the series the best run producer and the hardest to K in the game. Now twice in the set, the Reds have retired him in a big moment. Make the hitter get a little more aggressive just like that. What an at bat. Fourth strikeout for Quantrill. You see, and, and we, I, I did say off the top, Quantrill not a big strikeout pitcher, but he has four because he's been ahead of those hitters. He's made some quality pitches. That's when strikeouts come. Oh yeah, How about I mean that. That's just that's just some filthy pitching right there. 95 pitches for Quantrill, 69 strikes, and after a couple of high fastballs, say good night with the changeup. Tied at one, Tyler Naquin due to lead off to left center field. In between effort comes up empty for Palacios. Naquin turns and has to race back. Good recovery to get the ball in. Serve to center field. Down base hit. Naquin rips through second and they concede his advance. Straw lobs it to second base. Moran splashes one to center and it's met at the corners. So Reynolds at first and this is the first chance for the Reds on the game with a man in scoring position. Farmer swings ground ball through base hit. Naquin jogs home. Kyle Farmer connects again and he puts the Reds ahead. It's two to one. Albert Almora Jr. squares to bunt drops it down. Stefan has to field has no play at third. Tall throw to first gets away. Delino to Shields plummets down as Reynolds scores. So he gets the sacrifice. And the errant throw. Now Mora does help get the run in with aid from the miscue. I'll, I'll tell you, you know, you can tell that the bunt is no longer in vogue because teams don't really even defense the bunt like they used to. And it's sent to left field. Farmer back to tag. Palacios makes the catch. Farmer tags, races home, the throw to the plate offline. And the slide in for Farmer, sack fly RBI. It's a three run inning for the Reds. They lead four to one. And the table is set here in the eighth inning with Jose Ramirez coming to the plate. Oh, man, right off of his foot and rolls it back out toward the pitcher. And he might need him. Now that hurt, man. That, uh, did that get him in the shin? Straight down. You see, oh, oh right above, it. maybe even got above the shin guard. But not good. That hurt. Yeah, you don't see him down like that very often. He's going to stay in there only because it was going to be a fist fight if they tried to drag him off the field. And a chopper towards first. It's in the hole. It gets through around third. Scoring is Miles Straw. And now Frito kicks the ball. And that enables Quan to go all the way to third. And you've got Guardians at the corner. Still only one out. And Jose Ramirez. The American League leader and runs batted in has number 34 on the year. And now they're going to get a runner for Jose because he's obviously still in a lot of pain. So Jose will leave the game and we'll keep a close eye on that. Reds are looking for three final outs. And Tony Santion oblige. Will hit to right. Friedel has it red. For the first time ever, the Reds sweep Cleveland at Cleveland. They take both ball games and provide a broom cleaning of their neighbor to the north.